This is quite incredible. Mike is here from Rico. Good to see you, Mike. Yeah, How are you? Yeah, yeah excellent. <laughs> it's quite bizarre looking, looking at you <laughs> yeah, behind the camera. the camera. Why is a digital camera so special? What makes it special? Okay, it's very, very much the latest in technology. It's um, basically, there is no film. No film at all? No film. So therefore, you don't have to buy the films. You don't have to process the films. So where does the image go? Is it, is it got a memory of sorts? or? Yeah, basically what's happened is that uh, it's digital. It's got a CCD, uh, it's got a memory chip inside it okay. with two megabytes of uh, memory. So therefore, basically, as I take the picture, I capture it on the memory in the camera, and therefore, basically, that is it. It's immediate. So, so if I want to take a picture, yeah. let me take a picture of you. As, as we see, we can view... I'm not very technically monitor. minded, so two megabytes means how many pictures to me? Up to 41 images. 41 images 41 at any one images. point can be stored in here. That's right. right. So basically you can capture up to 41 images, but unlike, again, conventional film, where maybe you take the uh, film, then you have to wait uh, a couple of days or maybe a few weeks till the end of the film. Yeah. Then you take it into the processing house, then you get the pictures back. I mean, that costs you £10 a time, doesn't it? Whatever. It, yeah, I mean, this, it, this, with the film this. and the processing. But it also, you, there's no wait. So this is very, very straightforward. So take the picture, basically... Oh, yeah. We are now captured. No flash, no nothing, no flash needed. No, no, no. It's, uh, again, a sensitive OR CCD okay. in the camera. Right. So a little bit like camcorder technology, you don't necessarily need the flash. So we're taking pictures inside. So terrific so and low light, terrific and bright light, terrific all, all round. That's right. Just okay. general all round, great pictures. What is it you need to go alongside this to get and to be able to use the Ricoh camera? Okay. You need a, a computer. Yeah, basically you would need a, a personal computer. So anything uh, 486 or above. So basically if you're buying a PC this Christmas or if you bought one in the last 18 months or so, you will have a 486 or above. Okay. Uh, then you need a standard printer. So basically whatever printer you've got working with your PC, and basically that is what you need. Everything so you take else, the picture with the camera, it then yeah. goes into the computer That's right. and you can then print it off instantly. That's right. Wow. That's right. So again, that is the image I've just taken of you. Uh, we right. can see it there. Can so maybe. Fair enough. <laughs> okay, so can now... I, can I, before we go into it more on this, can I yeah. just, again, reiterate the price here? And you were talking to me about yeah. this before we started the That's show. Right. This is very important to get across. Because I don't know how we've done it. I, I guess it's because of the numbers that we actually buy at QVC for sure. you. We've got an introductory price here of 399.97. Now, without getting too technical, this is a very superior definition camera. You've got 576, sorry, 768 pixels by 576. Now, there are others on the market that are good, That's but right. are lower in pixel, which means the right. definition won't be as clear. That's right. Basically, the, uh, the, the key to the technology is the higher the resolution that you put into the camera, the higher the quality of the result you get out of it. 768 by 576 is um, above the industry norm. If you were maybe looking mm. at the adverts in the papers over the last few days, or if mm. you look in the high street, you would see that most of the digital cameras on the market now are 640 by 480 pixel. Sure. So a les lower resolution. It's a bit like when you look in a, a, in a newspaper and you see maybe a printed photograph or whatever. It's, it's those dots that make up the picture. The more that's dots right. you've got, the that's crisper right. the picture that is, is going to be. That's exactly what it is. Right. So uh, the more condensed, the crisper the picture. So look at the price then. 399.97. What is this recommended to retailer? What's the this, if you were to go and look in the high street uh, tomorrow morning yep. or if you've been looking uh, today, uh, you would normally pay £549 for the camera. £549 for the camera alone. That's right. Well, the camera alone, it comes with the software, which is Windows uh, 3.1 or Windows yeah. 95 compatible. Uh -huh. It also comes with a pouch case, all the instructions, all the cables. So basically everything you need apart from the PC and the printer. Now the thing, we're going to go into more demonstration on this in a second, but the thing to point out is that a lot of you who are maybe thinking about getting one of these cameras will be only too well aware of the value that you can see on your screen there. Those of you that aren't, and those of you that haven't maybe thought about getting this before, go and check now, go and look in the press, go and look in the adverts, go and look in the glossy magazines and see how much this camera or ones like it are going for, then quickly call us because the stock is going very fast. That's right. So it's, um, again, the other thing that you get with this camera, you buy it from QVC today, you get the AC mains adapter. Right. Now, uh, basically that enables you, so when you, obviously when you're out and about taking your pictures, you don't want to be plugged into the mains. Okay, so it fine. works off the batteries which come with it, right. standard pen light batteries. So if you normally buy the camera on its own, you wouldn't get that mains adapter. So how no, much is that mains adapter The mains adapter, adapter you would pay £60. That's the suggested selling price on the mains adapter. Again, So we've gone up to £610 now then. That's right. Wow. That's right. And our price, £399.97. Okay, so Crazy. really the key to it is higher quality resolution in the camera at a price cheaper in, than uh, you would find in most high street outlets for a lower resolution Product. How easy is it to use? Do you have to be technically minded at all? It's, if you can use a camera, you can use a digital camera. It's very, very much point and shoot. Right. Again, let me... I uh, love the fact you've got a big screen there. But you can, yeah. It's almost like a camcorder screen, isn't it? That's really? right. It's, uh, you just flick the button on there, and basically then what we have here is live images. So it's a real-time viewfinder. So as I move the camera around... 
Excellent. So great if you've got to kind of lift studio. up to get a photograph above a crowd or something yeah, like that. Again, it's, exactly uh, what, yeah, again, it's exactly, uh, exactly uh, one of the benefits of this camera. Although this camera also has the benefit of the optical viewfinder, so a conventional optical viewfinder right. with uh, eyesight correction. So if you wear glasses, again, it's just another extra uh, user-friendly touch. What about touch. things like focusing, for example? How does it know what focus. to focus on? Okay, it's where you're getting it's automatic focus. Again, it saves you time, it saves you money. Over there, we've got a training manual with, a, of course, a photographic image in the centre. You can really kind of gloss up maybe um, some, some studying, maybe you've got to do theses and all that sort of thing. For, it just for, for, adds for, for, an extra for sure. dimension to uh, any work that you're doing. Yeah. And the other thing as well, we're talking here about printed paper. Obviously, one of the benefits of this camera is, again, if you're using the, the uh, internet, the World Wide Web, yeah. or you're emailing images, again, once they're into your PC, you can then email them using Excellent. an email package. So if I could take the picture of you now, if we had an email package on our PC that we were using, we could be uh, send emailing that across your to image. Australia, America, yeah. Whatever. So yeah, we could be on the phone later on. We up know, against the clock. There's always another okay, thing sure. like this. Let's go onto the computer and show how easy it is to actually print out, but also change the image because you can do sure. all sorts of different things. I know you did some wonderful, yeah. wonderful things with Alison and me earlier on. Sure. So maybe if we bring Keith on. Okay. Yeah, Keith's here. The, uh, the computer. Where's Keith? <laughs> Hi, Keith. Good to see you. All right. Okay, so there's the actual screen there, and there's the computer. Right. First of all, I'd just like to show you that uh, once you've got the images in the camera, yeah. um, all you need to do is to connect the cable that's supplied with it mm -hmm. into the port here. Can I just take that from you so I can angle it towards the camera? Yeah. So the cable that comes with it, you just put it in and connect it into that yep. socket Yeah, you can there. probably see it better here. Okay. okay, the cable's connected and the mains cable's If we look at the one that's actually here. on the table down there, it's all done there, so... If we just look over here, if you follow me down, there we are, just yep. there, that's not just connected. here. Okay. So we are now connected, we can download into the PC. Mm -hmm. What I've got here is the software that's provided with it, which is Photo Studio. Okay. It's a very comprehensive package because it, it will enable you to keep uh, or manage your pictures in albums. I've got an album so on... So you just load it as you would do any other software? Yes, right. yes, you, it, com it, it, it comes on floppy disks and you load it into your software. As Mike said, it's... It actually comes on sorry, a CD-ROM. On CD-ROM, um, yeah. It's uh, Windows 95 and Windows 3.1 compatible. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got several albums on the screen here. Download the images to your album. Once they're there, you can then double-click. Is that to, to an easy process to do? It is a very easy process. It's very fully featured. It's got a whole range of tools down here, very, very comprehensive uh, for masking off areas, right. to enhance certain areas, um, to, to do all sorts of special effects. It's not just a piece of software for downloading, it is very fully featured. Am I right in saying that you can also edit them like you can on the camera, you can actually edit them on the screen as well on the computer? Yeah, if you've got something downloaded to the album, you don't like it, you can delete it. And, and you can also, I, I notice over on the board over there, you've given our Glenn Thompson a moustache and there's our yep. Debs as this, well. This, this is an example not of... Not with a moustache, I think. <laughs> this, this is an example of something that, that we've done previously, we added a moustache. Yeah, um, I'll just come over here. Up here, uh, I, sh I show an example of actually cutting face out, uh -huh. which we could paste anywhere just for a bit of fun. So this is one that we took, if you just look up to the left hand side, one that we took earlier on today with myself and Alison before we did our show earlier, what you've done is actually um, cut out Alison's face as it were and, and moved it um, and, and you can do all sorts of things. Oh, like I could paste that trickery. in there, so if you want to become part of Boy Zone or whatever, you can cut your own face out and paste it in. Uh, if you want to put yourself, uh, if we could just come down to this picture down the bottom here, if you wanted to paste yourself in in front of your favourite football team, then you could do as that. Well. If we bring Mike in as well. Could you just recap on everything that you get in the kit? Because we're, yeah, we're sure. talking an awful lot about the technology here. You get sure. the camera. Sure, so you obviously get the camera, you get the batteries with the camera, so it made, immediately you can make it work. Mm -hmm. As we said, you get the AC adapter, the mains connection, which in the high street you would normally pay an extra £60 for. So we're looking now roughly if this was a, a high street purchase today. If I was out, I'd be looking 549 for the camera and £60, so over... Six Six hundred ten pounds. Over six hundred pounds. So it's a real saving, a realistic, genuine saving of over two hundred pounds of what the recommended retail price and indeed what they are being the, sold for. The street for selling price. That's yeah. right. And, and as we say, we get all the instruction books, we get all the cabling, we get the pouch case, we get the software on CD. So it's for Windows uh, three point one or mm -hmm. Windows ninety five. Mm -hmm. So really everything, as we say, apart from the PC and the printer that you need to start taking. Oh, okay. Let's get Susan in on this, who's bought one of these. Hello, Susan, welcome. Hi, good evening. Hello, how are you? Hi, Susan. I'm very well, thanks. Now, have you been uh, shopping around for a digital camera well, like this? Well, my husband has. I bought this for my husband. Terrific. So he's been looking around, and he reckoned the cheapest one he saw was 1200 so this is good value. Whoa, <laughs> cheapest one he's seen was 1200 pounds. Crikey, yeah. okay. So he's been looking around for how long? Quite a while? Um, oh, well, only the last couple of months, really. Right. Yeah. What? But we bought it because we're going to the States in February. Terrific. Right. So what I wanted to ask really was, 
um, you know, you said 40 pictures. Yeah. Um, how do we get more than 40 pictures? Do we have to have two CDs or...? No, 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 it's a, it's a very good question. Um, on the side of the camera, so there's two megabytes internal memory on the camera. So when the camera uh, comes, is delivered to you, basically you can use it immediately. Right. Um, uh, to do so that. So use it over Christmas. Right. Yes. Yeah. Then uh, there's a, an option we have got uh, actually extra memory cards as well for anyone else like yourself possibly thinking of taking it on the holiday maybe wanted to take more uh, right. we, here they come details of these will be on the screen now as well okay so the first one we're looking at there is, is a four megabyte storage card that yeah, will I give can't you see the screen <laughs> oh okay yeah. so uh, it's, it's a, an extra memory card right. it's about the size of a credit card and it just slides into the side of the camera we'll show you in just a minute right. but a four megabyte uh, card gives you an extra 80 images that so you've got the 41 enough. in the camera and then an extra 80 on the card. So a total of 121. And when you bear in mind you're saving over 200 pounds off the recommended retail price, for another 100, you've got all that extra memory as well, which right, is Right, I see. Brilliant. And again, on the card, they are totally reusable as they are on the camera, so you can edit it. So right. again, it just slots into the side of the camera. Uh, and then again just a little slide button underneath takes it out again. But again if you want more than that we've actually got two more options to show everybody as well. The 4 megabyte we just showed you, this is the 8 megabytes. So 8 that megabytes, really again, that it? gives you up to uh, 160 images so right. effectively yeah, doubling up on the 4 megabyte. So you're 41 images in the, car, in the camera with the internal memory plus an extra 160 using the 8 megabyte card. If you were to select the 20 megabyte uh, storage card. Whoa! <laughs> okay, we're going up now to how many? Now we're getting so really that, big. That will give you up to 399. Wow. Incredible. Mike, thanks for a great demonstration. Thanks, Dave. It's back with me later, isn't it? 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock tonight. 11 o'clock to thanks to Keith as well. Thank you. Okay, in a minute we're going to be back uh, talking washballs, going from one